Hey guys, I'm going to be doing my top 15 favorite winter scents from Candles by Victoria. And I want to apologize. I watched my video that I did a second ago on my top 20 fall scents. And I want to apologize for the glare in my glasses. I would take them off, but I literally can't see diddly squat without them because I'm as blind as a bat. And uh, I would wear my contacts, but yesterday while Adam and I went to the grocery store, something irritated my eye. I don't know if maybe I got an eyelash in there or a mascara or what, but it turned bright pink and started gushing water. I had to take out my contact, throw it away, and people were staring at me like I had leprosy or something. I think that they thought that I had pink eye, and they're probably thinking, what are you doing in a grocery store? Don't be touching all the food. You have pink eye and all this other stuff, but it cleared up whenever, after I got home, thank the Lord. I just, it started itching and burning and hurting. I don't know what was in it. I have no idea, but it's better now. So that's why I'm wearing my glasses. So I apologize for the glare. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and get started. These are going to be in no particular order. First one I have is Peppermint Bark. And this is in the Halo Red Glitter. Perfect for Christmas time. Super pretty. My camera's not going to pick it up. This smells just like Andy's Mints to me which I love, so I really like this scent a lot. Next one I have is Whispering Winds, and this is one I got whenever I was visiting Victoria back in May. I wouldn't have chose this scent for myself, ever, and it's amazing. It's kind of a little bit fruity, and it's definitely got the peppermint in it because it's cooling. I don't really hear people talk about this one that much, but it's excellent. You definitely need to try this one. It's really, really good. And I will continue to uh, order this one. Next one I have is... Let's see. Cinnamon Apple Cider Snap. And this is in those cute little coffee cups that uh, Victoria came out with last year. Sorry, it's not picking up how cute this is. And mine has like a little milk stain on his beard, if you can see that. It's so cute. Oh, uh, this is perfect Christmas time scent. Smells like Christmas to me. And I'm sorry, these, I don't know if I mentioned, these aren't available anymore. These were limited edition. So I'm sorry to show you it in this cute little container that you can't get anymore, but that's the only form that I have it in. You need to try that scent, this scent for this Christmas if you haven't tried it yet. Wonderful. Next, I have... Cold December night, and this is in the blue and silver glitter. Probably not picking up how pretty it is on camera like it is in real life. I love it. It's beautiful. And the scent matches it perfectly. This is um, Sweet Snow and Sugared Spruce, I believe. And I can't remember who came up with this. I'm sorry. So good. Smells like a Christmas tree with peppermints hanging on it. Really good. Perfect for winter. Okay, the next one I have is Crackling Birch. And this one I think has the... It has some kind of mint in it. I'm pretty sure it's peppermint. And maybe some patchouli. I don't know, it smells like a tree with the branches breaking off, covered in snow to me. It's really good for winter time. I like that one a lot. Next I have Eskimo Kisses, and this was a create a scent by Deb. Oh, this is perfect. It's Spearmint and Vanilla Bean Noel. Excellent. I need like a mustard jar in this really good and super strong with just this little mini jelly jar it fills my whole house yeah you can even smell it outside that's how strong that is okay next I have sugared spruce and this is in another cute little jar or coffee cup that isn't available anymore I'm sorry so it's like a Christmas tree like a sweet Chris Christmas Christmas tree but sorry that one's really, really good. 
Okay, next I have Christmas Memories. And this smells like Christmas time in Hobby Lobby to me. It's got that craft store smell to it a little bit. To my nose, anyways. Other people may not get that from it. I like that one a lot. And then this one is Cinnamon Appleberry. And this is a really good transition from fall to winter. It's a good in-between scent. You get the cinnamon, you get the apple, and you get the berry. And the cinnamon isn't overpowering. That one's delicious. Now I have... the 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 Can't talk today, y'all. Vanilla Bean Noel. And this is in the other really cute coffee cup that you can't get. I'm sorry. I wouldn't show you if I had it in a different form. Really good. It smells just like the one from Bath and Body Works. Perfect, yummy vanilla scent. Really good. I like that one a lot. Next I have Sweet Snow. I love Sweet Snow so much. Smells like, um, peppermints to me. I think it's got peppermint and maybe vanilla bean Noel or something. I'm not sure. Sorry, I'm sniffing it a lot, but this is like my favorite minty scent right here. Sorry. I have it in a Melissa's body lotion too, and I want to get it in everything possible in the... Bath and Body line. It's fantastic. Next I have Snowberry. This one's really good too. Um, it's got the cooling so I think it's got peppermint in it. And you get berries for sure. It's really interesting. It's I, I like this one a lot. This is another one I got whenever I went to visit Victoria. Really good for winter time. Sorry, I'm not prepared for these videos. Clearly, I should write down what's in these scents so I can actually tell you. Okay, next I have Warm Christmas Splendor. This one's really good. This is another smells just like Christmas to me scent. I think it's got peppermint in it too because it's cooling as well. I like those cooling scents apparently really good. I like that one a lot. Next I have Cinnamon Raisin Bread. And this one is one that could be a transition scent from fall to winter as well. A good in between. I ordered this one because Deb was always talking about it. And it's really good. I, I, I understand where the hype comes from. You get the cinnamon and you get the raisin and you get the bread. It's really good. Great bakery scent. And the last one that I have is Snickerdoodle. This one's really good. Um, it's got that cherry almond scent to it a little bit, so if you don't like that, you may not like this one, but it smells like a Snickerdoodle cookie to me. Cinnamon and sugar and dough. It's really good. I like it. Okay, that's all for my winter scents, and I think I'm going to do a top 20 favorite all-time, top 20 favorite all-year-round scents. I think that's a good one. So, I think I'm going to go ahead and go do that, and I'm going to go ahead and post this one to YouTube. So, y'all have a good day. Bye.